Jaw pain on one side, causes and treatment. Jaw pain may occur on one side of the jaw or both sides. Some conditions may cause pain on one side of the jaw, which may travel to the opposite side. This pain is not usually a cause for concern and may result from sinusitis, oral health issues or TMJ disorders. People can treat these causes at home or a doctor can prescribe a suitable treatment method. This video will explore the possible causes of one-sided jaw pain, how a person may reduce jaw pain symptoms and the available treatment options. Potential causes of one-sided jaw pain TMJ disorder or TMT The temporomandibular joint connects the temporal bone of the skull to the mandible or jaw bone on each side of the jaw along with the jaw muscles the TMJ allows for jaw movements such as chewing sucking swallowing opening the mouth an older research research study showed that more people had unilateral symptoms as they chewed more on the affected side temporomandibular disorders or TMD refers to conditions that cause jaw joint and muscle pain and dysfunction of these structures. This disorder may affect one side of the jaw or both. Disorders that may affect the TMJ include disc disorders. This disc can dislocate on one side of the jaw causing friction, pain, difficulty opening their mouth fully jaw getting stuck open tmj arthralgia a person may experience pain within the tmj itself for various reasons including infections within the joint or inflammation they may also experience the following pain in the jaw or other parts of the face pain when chewing or speaking popping or clicking noise when moving bone destruction there may be the destruction of the jaw bone in conditions such as osteoarthritis osteoarthritis may cause the articular disc or breakdown leading to inflammation and pain in the tmj on one side how common is temporomandibular disease According to the National Institute of Dental and Craniofacial Research, the prevalence of TMJ and temporomandibular muscle disorders ranges between 5 to 12 percent. Treatment The available treatment option will depend on the severity of TMD. Conservative treatment may reduce symptoms in 50 to 90 percent of people. Conservative treatments include a diet consisting of soft foods such as mashed potato or liquid food such as soup. Rest. Applying a warm compress on the affected area of the jaw. Gentle stretching of the jaw. A person may require over-the-counter pain medications such as non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs to ease the pain. Oral health. A person may also experience one-sided jaw pain due to the oral health or dental issues oral health issues that may be causing pain in the jaw joint may include tooth decay or cavities grinding or clenching the teeth or bruxism dental abscess a growing wisdom tooth misaligned teeth gum disease how common are oral health issues According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, 80% of people will have at least one cavity by the age of 34. Additionally, between 2009 to 2014, 4 in 10 adults over 30 had gum diseases. Treatment The treatment options will depend on the type of oral health issue a person is experiencing. For example, a common treatment option for tooth decay 
and cavities is a filling. A dentist will remove the decayed tissue of the tooth and replace this with a filling material. For misaligned teeth, a person may require dental braces. This will correct the positioning of the teeth and align the lower and upper jaw. More significant orthodontic work or even surgery may be required if they are misaligned jaw bones. Sinusitis Sinusitis is the inflammation of the sinuses and nasal passages of the face. Sinusitis may occur due to the following colds, allergies, irritants, viruses, smoke, dust. A person with sinusitis may experience the following facial pain and pressure on one side of the jaw, facial fullness, a blocked nose, fever, difficulty smelling. How common is sinusitis? According to 2018 data from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, 28.9 million people in the United States received a diagnosis of sinusitis, while 2,34,000 visits to emergency de departments occurred with chronic sinusitis as the main diagnosis. Treatment Treatment for sinusitis may include humidification, nasal wash, decongestants, in some cases intranasal or oral steroids. A person may require antibiotics if a doctor determines that the cause of the sinusitis is bacteria. Trigeminal Neuralgia Trigeminal Neuralgia or TN is a long-term condition that affects the trigeminal nerve. The trigeminal nerve is one of the 12 nerves that connect to the brain and it is responsible for sensation in the face and the mouth. A person can experience two types of trigeminal neuralgia, type 1 and type 2. Type 1 trigeminal neuralgia causes flashes of pain on one, on one side of the face triggered by light touch. Type 2 trigeminal neuralgia causes a constant aching, burning and stabbing pain less severe than type 1. How common is trigeminal neuralgia? The incidence of trigeminal neuralgia is approximately 12 per 1 lakh people per year. Trigeminal neuralgia occurs more frequently in people over the age of 50 and in women. Treatment First line treatment for trigeminal neuralgia is typically medication and a person may use this alone or in combination. Trigeminal neuralgia that is not responsive to medication may require surgery such as balloon compression, glycerol injection, radio frequency ab ablation, stereotactic radio surgery, microvascular de decompression. A person should discuss these possible options with their doctor. Osteomyelitis. Osteomyelitis is a bone inf infection. This may occur in the jawbone or other bones of the face. This infection may occur due to trauma, surgery or a lack of blood flow. It may also spread from some elsewhere in the body. A person with osteomyelitis may experience pain at the site of infection as well as the following fever, chills, swelling, warmth at the site of infection, raised red skin. How common is osteomyelitis? There is an estimated 2 to 5 cases of osteomyelitis per 10,000 people in the United States. Cases of osteomyelitis can happen anywhere in a person's body. Treatment Treatment for osteomyelitis will depend on the severity of the infection. Doctors will introduce antibiotics and it may also be necessary to clean and drain the area of infection. Tumors and cysts. A tumor occurs when 
abnormal or damaged cells grow and multiply uncontrol uncontrollably to form tissue lumps. Meanwhile, a cyst is a fluid-filled sac that forms in the skin and may protrude through the overlying skin. Benign tumors and cyst. Odontogenic cysts are infections that originate in the teeth or their supporting tissues. The two types of uh, types are developmental and inflammatory. The cysts tend to be asymptomatic unless they become inflamed. Malignant tumors. Ameloblastic carcinoma is a rare malignant tumor that normally originates in the bones of the jaw. Odontogenic. The lower jaw is the most common site for this tumor to develop. Some people may be asymptomatic. However, others may experience the following progressive pain and swelling, bleeding, headaches. In rare cases, a person may be unable to open the mouth, have voice hoarseness, experience tingling or numbness, lose their voice. Osteosarcoma is a malignant bone tumor and accounts for 6% of all osteosarcomas. Squamous cell sarcomas are the second most common malignancy of the jaws. Treatments Treatment for tumors and cysts will vary depending on several factors including the following type of tumor cyst number of tumors or cyst present their size if they are harmful or harmless some treatments may involve surgical removal for example a doctor may surgically remove the tumors or cyst malignant treatment options in malignant cases, treatment depends on the following primary tumor location, stage of the primary tumor, degree of malignancy, whether the tumor has spread, individual's age and general health. Possible options include surgical excision, adjunctive radiation, Radiation therapy, chemotherapy for osteosarcoma. A person can discuss the most suitable treatment based on the above factors and options. Remedies and treatments for general jaw pain. There are things a person can do to improve the pain. Some techniques include avoiding hurt foods using ice packs on the jaw point jaw joint taking over the counter pain medications such as ibuprofen avoiding extreme and repetitive movements of the jaw such as clenching or gum chewing learning relaxation and stress reduction techniques to limit jaw movement a person should also see their dentist for regular checkups to detect oral issues early